The Creode is a self-sustaining human settlement, resilient to external disturbances and capable of surviving the catastrophe of the Great Pacific Garbage Patch. It is a large floating platform supported by metal infrastructures that houses all the spaces necessary for the essential life of its inhabitants. As in ancient ideal cities, various housing services spread around a large covered market square such as factories, schools, hospitals, forests, homes, and tourist sites. They are metaphors of contemporary living. Indistinct voices. An incessant buzz reigns in the square. Everything moves. A gentleman wants to sell me a plastic fabric. Others buy clothes. A storm is about to come and I have nowhere to take shelter. Good thing they invented porches. Simon had been working in that factory for years. By now he had grown fond of its incessant daily life. He had been late that evening on the platform sipping which remained of an old distillate that someone had forgotten there for a long time, drank and observed the drift that the society he lived in was taking. He focused on the stains on the work tools, on the degradation of those tools that he himself had once contributed to understanding how they functioned. Looking towards the water, he took the last sip and turned off the neon light whose intermittency had caused him a strong pain in his temples. It wasn't long before I returned to the old school, which a few years earlier had been the scene of my greatest adventures. The thin walls told of the time spent in there. They remembered the days spent joking with each other. However, I feel I must thank this homeland, a no man's land that perhaps will never exist, for giving me even just for an instant the illusion of another world, an instant vision that opened a passage in the dark recesses of my mind. People are hungry. You crazy little pigs who would even eat your mother when your tummy rumbles. Eat this plastic. It is just revenge for all the years in which you closed your eyes in front of the catastrophe. What is gold does not always glitter. We are subatomic particles in a constant, aimless collision. This is what science teaches us. In this sense, we seek collaboration between species. The plants suck the life of the fish, which in their incessant navigation move towards new drifts. Day number 9999 in airframe ZFH964. Since I've lived here, I feel like I know myself much better. Yet only three months have passed. The earth seen from here is a handkerchief and I have much more time to bask in my elusive internal analyses. On clear days, life here passes slowly. During the day, you read books and organize role-playing games with the other inhabitants, while in the evening, you look at the sky from the openings of the tiny blocks. I even learned the name of each star, the times of the moon, and the shapes of the clouds. The other day, it was a rainy Sunday, and therefore the waves rose high, driven by the even stronger wind in the open sea. We all immediately set off, this is the moment of greatest danger for our job. The strong winds risk carrying the plastics of our phalanstery even further forward, and at that point, we have to do it all over again. Oh yes, this is the price you have to pay to atone for your sins, collecting the waste, which moves away due to the wind and increases as the days go by. And then you have to collect everything all over again as well as the additions, in a circle little by little more and more complex. But then our earthly superiors call it rehabilitation. And in fact, if initially I suffered a little from this forced seclusion, I must say that I don't miss any of you remaining on the shore. Lost in the labyrinth, we return face to face with nature, 
whose great challenge appears increasingly imminent before our eyes. Gaia is present. She gives no respite and disturbs and shakes the electric wires in our hair. The branches of the trees are interstellar connections that open a gap in the network of our gazes. Do you want a one-of-a-kind experience and two weeks of absolute rest? But don't you want to give up the fascinating risk of an extreme experience? Come visit us. We have large tents where you can stay with your family or park your family and go and have fun. You will be able to live a 360 degree experience with long walks by the sea, music in the square in the evening, and fresh fish every day for dinner. Your mother-in-law will be thrilled. One step away from all essential services, close to a supermarket and pharmacy, large accommodations of approximately 12.5 square meters each with a private area, bedrooms, kitchen and bathroom that can be dismantled. Our agency boasts a long experience in the sale and rental of any type of property. Apartments, studios, two-room apartments, holiday homes, prestigious properties, villas, artisanal, commercial, industrial properties and warehouses. For information, contact the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, 01003 Sub District.